Hugh Tao added into Fortnite? Maybe not quite, but that was kind of what I first thought when I saw this bundle. I probably won't purchase this bundle, but this skin, and all these skins are really nice. I've just got some really nice ones that I already enjoy, but I felt this entire pack was quite heavily inspired, even sort of the aesthetic by Genshin. I believe the artist that's behind these skins is quite related to MMORPGs, not Genshin, but I believe some others. I, I'm, I've heard that through the grapevine. But before we check these out, reason I say that is because when I first saw this character, I instantly thought, wow, they've actually added Hugh Tao. Obviously a little bit different, but her, her eyes are very similar. Very, very similar. Uh, I don't know if this is meant to be like a lace top, but either way, it's the first style I've seen do sort of a lace style. And there's a game, I used to play out quite like it's Narica Blade Point. They do quite a nice lace uh, skins in that game. But I thought this variant, if I was to purchase it, it would be the one I go for. I really quite like this. I think this is a really cool, cool looking skin. It's just a shame it's not part. It's part of this bundle, and it's not part of, on its own. You can just buy it in the shop. So you have to get it with uh, get it as part of this set. But overall, obviously, you don't you wouldn't want this back bling on it. But overall, I thought this this is the high stakes bundle. So they've all got these uh, essentially, I guess, like sort of uh, dragon dragon slayer vampire slayer what's she called joni the scarlet utal the fourth and her weapons really sort of genshin inspired as well we've got this sort of like claymore that's uh that's reactive uh i believe that's with the reaction on but i think it will react as you swing it it will uh, it will change nothing too special there but again a really nice wrap to go with that it looks really quite nice with a little bit of gold highlights. We've got a formal Lucian West. I like this skin, particularly from the front. I thought this was quite cool. Uh, and he's got a black variant of it as well. The bit that I didn't like about this is kind of the back. I don't know. Maybe obviously the back bling is fine and obviously not too bothered about it. But there's so much detail on the front of the character. It's a bit of a shame that the back is... Is rather quite bland in in comparison. But all of these have all got like a mask. But I'd say the the unmasked variant is definitely a nicer version of it. Uh, well, it's sort of a nod to the switch or something here. We've got the blue and red wristband. Oh, actually, that's quite a uh, nice back bling. Getting a pickaxe. I mean, I'd say the W's out of this pack are a big time. Uh, this skin here in this set, and a lot of people like the healthy skin. I didn't. I missed out on that battle pass. See, that's another nice weapon as well. A good, a good value in in something like this, particularly if you haven't got many skins in Fortnite and you just have the battle passes. But you like, I could see this healthy skin being popular. That's a really nice one. Someone said, I think it was Ninja said she's like sort of got a lot, a lot of sort of Team Rocket uh, vibe going on with her, and I'd, I can, I see that. I see that. It looks pretty good. She's got a nice wrap and pickaxe as well to go with her. But I thought we'd take a look at this. This is this character here, this Joni. I still would like this character annoyingly. She is cool. I don't know how popular she will be. But I don't really want to have to buy this bundle just for this this skin. Although you could argue for the price. It's, it's a very fair price. Particularly this version. I really like that. I think that's really cool. But anyway, a little bit of clickbait. If you enjoyed this video anyway, please leave a like. Uh, if you're new, subscribe. Thank you very much. And uh, I'll see you in the next video. Bye.